So what I thought we'd talk about today is this notion, actually it's an actuality, of, of people and how they relate to themselves, how they think about themselves, which uh, believe me, I've done this a lot in my career, my athletic career. One of the turning points actually in my career was when I started to see how the self-judgment uh, and the and the real negative harshness towards myself was really interfering with not only my performance, but also the enjoyment of the entire process of, of training for the Olympics. And later on in, in working with people, I think the thing that I'm, I'm most passionate about is, is getting people to see and to recognize and to be aware of, of how, what they do to themselves in terms of uh, the self-talk. Uh, and also, beyond that, it's like the thinking, the ongoing conditioning, the thinking in which impedes them from really enjoying where they are right now. So, in most cases, it's based on a, a lifetime of cycles. And you go into this cycle of, 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 of a middle age, and if you go and lament about, oh, god damn it, I, I'm, shit, this is horrible, I'm getting old. It's like, well, first of all, yes, it is what it is. There ain't nothing you can do about it. It affects all of us. Number two, it's unproductive to say that. And number three, it starts to spin it as a negative. And if you, if you spin enough negatives, all of a sudden you're burdened with this sense of, you know, life sucks. Uh, and then you lose your enjoyment. So a great deal of my work with people and a great deal of work with myself uh, has been understanding the limitations of enjoying one's life and one's being in one's body by conforming to and buying into certain thoughts and concepts about themselves as opposed to just simply dealing with what's happening right now in your life and how your body feels right now and what your energy level is right now and doing the very best you can and not spinning it in terms of what I can't do or you know, life sucks. So bringing a, a passion to your life and where you are at that moment uh, and letting go of, of those thoughts. I like to use the phrase, uh, don't go there. So if I have a client that says, oh, you know, I'm hurt and I'm, I'm starting to get old, I get, ah, 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 don't go there. Don't, if you really want to, I mean, go right ahead, but I'd really advise against it. All of these thoughts about, I can't do, and I used to be able to do this, but I can't, yeah, so what? But I, well, maybe when I get older, I'm not going to be able to, yeah, that's, that's later, that's not now. Like right now, what can we do just to enjoy where you are? That's what it's about. Enjoyment in being in your body, and therefore enjoying being in your life.